How's it going guys? My name is Wanzy Bennett and welcome back to my Fire Red Omega Moemon Nuzlocke. And unfortunately, you want to see how the team looks? Uh, it was six Pokemon last episode. We had six. Now we have two. We lost two of the three starters that we were given along the way. We lost Sarah the Nidoran. And we lost uh, a little bitch. It's fine. <laughs> God damn it. I was so, so happy with the team that we were building. And then this stupid Dig Swagger Onyx with Dragon Breath for some stupid reason decides to come in and shit all over our progress. <sighs> Fuck my life. Oh, Wanji. I'm glad I caught up to you. I'm Professor Oakside. I've been asked to deliver this, so here you go. We got the running shoes! Now I don't have to use this speed up button as much. Press the B button to run, but only when there's room to run. Well, I must be going back to the lab. Bye bye. Alright mate, see you later. Thank you for the shoes. There's a letter attached. Dear Wanzi, here's a pair of running shoes from my beloved challenger. Remember, I'll always cheer for you. Don't ever give up. From Mom. <gasps> no! Mom! No! I read it in Professor Oak's voice. That means Professor Oak's boning mom. Unfortunately. Oh well. <laughs> Route 3. Can we catch a Pokemon here? Or is there any grass here? Yes, there is. We can get a Pokemon. But no. We're not going to be doing any training with twos yet. We're going to get ourselves a Grove Oil before we do. Or at least attempt to. We're probably going to need some grinding at some point. Excuse me. You looked at me, didn't you? Oh my god. You're such a creep. Oh my god. Okay. Janice from accounting. Shut! It's Janice from accounting, boys. And you have a pigeon. Fuck my life. Right. Toozy, get out here. Tackle. I'm gonna thundershock you in the face and kill you. And you have a tailor, which I'm also gonna thundershock in the face and kill. Killing all them little girls, you know what I mean? Right. Let's go. Let's go. Hey, I saw you in Viridian Forest. W well, why aren't you in the forest anymore? <laughs> okay. Okay, Col <gasps> Colton. What are you doing here, Colton? That's a Metapod. What? What is that sprite, though? Just, just what is that sprite? It's just not the kind of thing that I expect to see when I open up a Pokemon game. I mean, I don't expect to see little girls in cosplays. <laughs> the Trico sprite looks really weird from the back. It's got gloves on, and that's a Kakuna. There's the girl sprout. The girl scout. Damn Girl Scouts. They're always trying to steal my goddamn cookies. And their prices are always so extortionate. I can't deal with them. I can't deal with Girl Scouts. Then again, we don't have Girl Scouts here. We have brownies. Ah, well. Brownies are... I don't believe that little girls can fly. Get down on the ground. You're breaking the laws of physics. Gravity is a thing that needs to be respected. Can't just defy the laws of gravity like that, you damn little girl. What do you think you're doing? And now you have psychic powers as well. Get down from the ground this instant. I'll tell your mother. She won't be happy. <laughs> God's sake. <laughs> what is wrong with me? Wait. There are other kinds of Pokemon than the ones you find in the park. You don't see. I thought there was only one. Hi. I like shorts. Duh. <laughs> They're delightfully comfy and easy to wear. <laughs> I don't know what I don't know why I did that voice, but alright. Right. Watch this, guys. Watch this. I'm gonna disappear. Two seconds. Let there be light! It didn't turn on. There we go. A bit better. Needed a bit more backlight because it was a bit dark in my room and it's making me depressed. <laughs> Ratata. That's interesting. I didn't expect you to look like that in this game. An absorb still kills you. And we have an Ek- She has no feet. Let me repeat that. She had no feet. <laughs> but we have a Grove Oil now. And it's trying to learn Pursuit, which could be useful against Psychic types. So I'm probably going to get rid of the- I don't need Pound and Quick Attack. Bye Pound! Pound has no benefit to using at all. And we have a little 14 Elekid, but now we're about to get our first evolution. 
Heldens! You're about to become more than a gecko! <laughs> We're about to see... Oh, I don't think I've actually used the Grove Oil in Moemon. I don't think I actually got one. Might have done, I'm not sure. Little girl shouldn't make noises like that. Theory Cutter. Eh, that's not too bad, I guess. Oh, it's bug and it's only 10 power in this generation. So yeah, it's bad. Oh, we need to go back and heal. And I'm going to sneeze. I'm trying to hold in a sneeze so badly right now. Ah, It's weird. It's a weird, weird noise. Ah, I want to catch a Pokemon. We need, we need a new member. How many Pokeballs do I have? How many do I have? I have two. Let's go. Right, Pokemart. There we are. Let's go catch ourselves a cheeky something using... Oh, if you buy 10, you get a Premier Ball, don't you? No, you don't. Waste. Ah, well, let's get Paralyzed Heals. We already have enough potions, I think. Nope, can't buy any more. That'll do me for now. Don't need any... Ooh. No, I'll skip out on the Repel. Good things can happen if you raise... Good for you. What about you? Shady old guy sucked me into buying this weird fish... Magikarp! I want a Magikarp. Oh, that's a point. I can get, I can buy the Magikarp in this game. So I get two, three encounters in this episode if I can make it that far. Ooh, this could, oh, that's a lot of trainers. Are you a trainer? Let's get with it right away. That's a lot of trainers. Oof. Cascoon, go Heldens and pursuit it. One shot in it? Okay. Heldens, you beast. And a Silcoon. Oh, I didn't quite one-shot the Silcoon, but Heldens, you monster! I want one. <laughs> I want one. I just realised I can get hell. I can get my my uh, Weedle out of the the PC. So I think I'm going to do that. I want one. You have a beauty fly. These things get gust. Yep, go into Tuesday. Oh, no, 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 these things get gust and absorb upon level up. Ah, well, don't know why I tried to absorb a, a grove oil, but hey-ho. We'll just decimate it with a Thundershock. Right, let's go back again and get Shween out of the PC. Because it is always nice to have a Pokemon that is able to be Death Fodder. But I'm hopefully not going to keep Shween as Death Fodder. I'm going to try and use the Beedrill, because Beedrill's cool and it deserves to get moves like Megahorn. Uh, we put Shween... Oh, we also had Viewy. So our team isn't as small as it used to be. Ah, oh, well, that's pretty cool. It also means I am going to have a lot of editing to do for this episode, but it's fine. Ah, we're fine. We're fine, we're fine. We just got to follow the flow of events. Let's do this. Right. Let's go. Let's go, boys. Route 3 back. Let's keep going. How long have I been recording for? Eight minutes. It's only been eight minutes. Wow. It feels like a bit longer. Ah well. It's good to nice. Uh, good to have a little handle. That look you gave me. It's so intriguing. Hmm. Baby. <laughs> Sally with a Pichu, who's about to get destroyed by Heldens. Because Heldens is gonna get paralyzed. <sighs> That's not fun, but it's fine. And you have neither. No. <gasps> Sarah, no. Wow, that's a strong need run. Until I pursued it. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I, I should probably put um, Toozy back out front. And I'll probably do some grinding of the other two off screen. But I I don't. I say off screen, I'm going to do grinding montages with music. Because I, I used to love doing that. With a Surskit. Get Thundershocked, mate! Get wrecked. And you also have a. Oh, I, the sprite for that's really weird. Really weird. It's also going to annoy me. Leah! Scratch. Okay, come on, let's just get rid of this. Those pigtails are so weird. <laughs> Why did I Leah again? I went to Karate Chop. Because it's cooler. Ah, well. That's gone, that's gone. Right, why am I going down? Why would I be coming down here? I'm going to go anyway. Hey, you're not wearing shorts. What's wrong with you? No, I'm not, Calvin. Are you wearing shorts? Oh, yeah, you are. Ah, well. Thundershock with Spearow. Bye-bye. Hand level up. And Swift. Swift is always cool. Apart from Taylor. Don't like Taylor Swift. I don't know why. 
She's a little bit of an annoyance for me. I really can't stand her. Oh well. Basically because mainly I think she's a big, big old hypocrite, but... I mean... Eh, I just don't like Taylor Swift. I'm not too sure why. I uh, just... She irks me for some reason. There's something about that woman. But anyway, we get a new encounter here. What are we gonna get? Come on, something good, please. Yep! Yep! Boom! 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 I want you in my room. Please don't kill this full pix with Karate Chop 2Z. Please don't kill it. You are a legend. Let's go. Oh god, let's not do that. Let's go and catch a Vulpix in a Pokeball. Boom, boom, boom. I'm gonna stop that. <laughs> Come on, Vulpix. You know, you need to join me. Pokeball, go. Come on. Come on. One, two, three. Yes! Vulpix. Tasty, tasty, tasty Vulpix. What do I call a Vulpix, though? While young, it has six gorgeous tails. When it grows, several new tails are sprouted. I don't believe humans have tails. Give a nickname. Uh, da, da, da. Oh god, that... that. <laughs> what do I call you, Vulpix? It's a male Vulpix. I don't think there are males in this universe, but hey-ho. Let's call it... Oh, I have no idea. Let's double check. Uh, let's ask my Twitter. My Twitter says I should call it... I don't know. Oh, I know. I got you. I got you. I got you. Because I've been watching ReZero. ReZero is really freaking good. And there's a girl in there called Ram. And there's also Rem. And I think I got the right one. And this thing is holding a Rostberry. That's useful. Very useful. <laughs> yeah, I think after this episode's done, I'm going to need to grind up my members. Of at least to level 10 or level 12 or something to a respectable level. Hello, fella. Yeah, you better take a rest. What's in this grass anyway? More Vulpixes that I can kill with Toozy. Or I could get roared away. Okay, bitch. Oh, wow, that's the boulder badge. Brock is cool. He's just not. He's not just tough. People like him, respect him. I want to be a gym with. Good for you. Anything on these rocks? Anything? They're. There has to be something, come on. They wouldn't just shove a load of random rocks here as part of the scenery and then miss the opportunity to actually, you know, put things on the rocks. They did. They ignored it. What are you talking about? Yes, you tripped over a geodude. Good for you. <laughs> Let's come in here. And we can also heal up our team, which is always a good thing. And we can speak to this man here. Not him. Not him. I think it's him. Hello there, sweep. Hi, I got the deal just for you. I'll let you have a secret Pokemon, a Magikarp, for just 500 Poke Dollars. So you'll buy it, am I right? See what happens if I say no. No? You say no? I'm only doing this as a favor to you. You don't know me! Don't do me favors, you don't know me! Hello there, sweetie pie, have I got a deal just for you. I'll let you have a secret Pokemon, a Magikarp, for just 500 Poke Dollars. So you'll buy it, am I right? Yes, it's always good to buy it. Paid an outrageous 500 Poke Dollars. <laughs> oh, I'm getting a phone call. Hang on a second. And I'm back. And my nose is probably very snotty, which is not fun. But we do have a Magikarp. And that's always fun. It's a female. I'm very, very scared to see what Magikarp looks like in this game. But we have a Magikarp. And we are going to do things and stuff with it, hopefully. So, what do we call you? Magikarp. Carp. Carp is a fish. Fish live in the ocean. The ocean is at the beach. The beach is fun. There are lots of girls on the beach wearing bikinis. Uh, bikinis are clothes. Clothes are worn by people. People are banter. I can't think. And I've just worked out the nickname for it. I don't know what I was thinking of when I was thinking about the beach. Let's just call it... <laughs> Let's just call you... Oh, this is probably a terrible, terrible name, and I'm probably spelling it wrong, but call it Aladdin. Do you get it? Well, I don't give refunds, you know what you were getting? I was getting a Magikarp, and Magikarp is cool, so I'm happy with that. Don't ever say that I'm not happy with a Magikarp, because I'm certainly happy with a level 5 Magikarp called Aladdin. <sighs> modest! A modest Magikarp! 
Are you actually kidding me? Um, I take it that has like no IVs as well. I reckon they've given me a magic art with like modest nature, terrible IVs, and all of the worst things you can even think of. <laughs> God damn it. So we do have uh, our team at the moment is magic. That is really weird sprite. But we have magic art, Vulpix, Weedle, Centret, Grove Oil, and Elekid. And we should. Oh, it has a Volt Absorb. I didn't realise that. Overgrow, Keen Eye, Shield, Dust, Flash, Fire, Swift, Swim. I didn't realise that had Volt Absorb. I thought it was Static. Hey, I'll take Volt Absorb, but Static is also fun. Right. So we have five minutes left before the end of this episode. Can I make it through Mount Moon in five minutes? I don't think so, but we'll get the encounter. And we'll see how far we get. So, Mount Moon. This is never fun. And we have Bullet Seed. That is also cool. What is the power of this? Let's have a look. TM Case. We have Rock Tomb and Bullet Seed. No. Rock Tomb, yes. Who wants to learn it? Heldens? You don't really need it, though. Do you need it? Does Heldens need it? Rock Tomb? I'm going to hold off for now. I don't want to teach it Rock Tomb just yet, anyway. But we do have an encounter, and that'll be... Why? Why do you do this to me? Let's be swift. Let's get, let's get a life and get... That's going to do nothing. You're going to do nothing. Karate chop. Keep karate chopping it for a bit. Get it as low down as possible. Don't do it. Don't piss off. Don't, don't, don't piss with me. There we are. Now get in the Pokeball before I smack you. Pokeball. Come on. Come on. Oh, just, just. I mean, Crobat isn't terrible. It's not a terrible Pokemon. Crobat is actually very useful and it does give us a flying type. So I'll, I'll take it. I will take it. I'll definitely take that. That's not bad at all. And it's a Zubat. And I always have a name for these things. So I don't know if I can fit it. Breaking... Yeah, that'll do. That'll do. Breaking Bat. Breaking Bat. Because Breaking Bat... It, it, I'm so... Not, I'm not funny. <laughs> and we have another one. Bye! Oh, it lived! Jesus Christ, that's a strong Zubat. And yeah, Mount Moon. Fun things. Suspicious men are in the cave. What about you? Woo! Okay, so, we have a Weedle. You're gonna die. <laughs> and you have a Beedle. That is also gonna die. Well, maybe not. C c can you... C c can you just... Just, just, c just can you... Yeah, thank you. <sighs> Bloody old Beedle. Why'd you have to be so annoying at the worst of times? Paralyzed Heal's nice, though. Okay, okay, okay. Potion, potion, potion. Time to potion it up. There we are. I really want to train everything else in... What in God's creation is that doing in here? Please just go away. Go away, Soul Rock. Whoa, that did a lot of damage. Out of my face. I don't want you. I don't want you anywhere near me. <laughs> We're getting out of here. I'm getting out of this cave. I can't deal with it right now. It's too high leveled, and there's shroom ravers all over the floor. <sighs> That's weird, Paris. We're getting out of here. I'm not dealing with it right now. We're going to go and heal up. And we need to train because that cave is going to claim someone's life. If I don't train a little bit. So, I don't care how long I've been recording for. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you have enjoyed, don't forget to go down below and leave a like and all that good stuff. And I will see you in the next episode. I hope you have a great day and a great life. And I will see you later. Take care of yourselves. Jesus Christ.